Hello, I'm the Kid Critic, and before I jump into this review on the Goonies, I have to tell you a few things. First of all, I am changing my name, yeah, so whenever you get a notification about me, um, it's gonna show the Critic, because I'm not that kiddish anymore. I am a certified tween. I am growing up. I'm an adult. You can't stop that. <sighs> but ser in all seriousness, I am changing my name to The Critic. Because I'm not going to stay a kid forever and whenever I want to join Channel Awesome, I can't be in... I can't make my name The Kid Critic on there because I'm not a kid. By that time, because you have to be 18. Um, but, in other news, look, look out for the Plasma Challenge video I'm making in the future. And also look out for the Star Trek reviews coming this Wednesday. And throughout the week I'll be doing one. And I'm not going to do that failed Back to the Future version. I'm just going to do reviews. So, jumping right into the Goonies review. This movie was incredible. Like, I know 80s movies are kind of cheesy and boring, but this is good. Like E.T., which I haven't reviewed yet, but I need to. It was good, it was strong, it was really good. Like, the story is about these kids who want to go on a treasure hunt, and they get chased down by like, criminals. I don't know why, but they... Get down there to the well, they find coins, but it belongs to a bunch of people up in the surface. So, then, they have to journey to the pirate ship, and, like, find all the treasure, and it belongs to, like, the ancient versions of the Goonies, and, like, it's awesome. Like, mmm. And... I guess it's alright to put the disabled person in the movie. Oh, nobody liked that person. Oh, let me ruin your childhood even more with that. They're making a Lego character out of that. Oh, oh no, you're so bad. <laughs> yeah, but I give this movie an A+. I really enjoyed it. Um, that's my review, and I will see you guys next time.